Hey everyone, welcome back to Jardev. Today I'm taking a look at a demo for a game that was actually released back in September of 2018. This is a game called Zero Ranger. Like I said, it was released in September 2018, 28th of September, and it's developed and published by System Erasure. I'm taking a look at this game at the request of Sean Headley, who got to request it because he backs to the top tier of my Patreon campaign, which you can find at patreon.com slash Jardev. Now this is a vertically scrolling 2D shoot 'em up with heavy emphasis on shooting, dodging, and mystery? Question mark. It says it has controller support. Um, it's it's working fine so far. So it'll become John. Finn. Yes. I think it's I think it's very bullet helly as well. Welcome, John. The unknown alien vessel, codenamed Green Orange, is approaching as we speak. <gasps> Looks like pumpkin. This is a training simulation created for your convenience. Um, this is a, a free demo that I got off their website. Uh, the full version is on Steam right now, but yeah, this is just the, the free version from their website. So it might look different from the full game. You'll be able to practice against the invasion in a safe environment. That's not how you spell environment. <laughs> you may use either one of our secondary fighters. Please note that although the simulation is extremely accurate to real life, the experience might differ in the final encounter. Aha. For one, you could actually die. Begin the simulation when begin the simulation when you're ready. Good luck. Perfect. Let's start it up. Oops. Okay, yeah, just just player two. Oh, okay, so we can be different types of ships. We'll just stick on this one, I guess. Start! I don't know if the analog sticks are going to work. Holy shit. Yeah, they do. Holy shit, this music. Can I shoot? Oh! There we go. A is shoot. Ow. Okay, so it's very asteroidy. Asteroids? Is that right? No. Uh. Space Invaders? <laughs> Possibly. But with a fucking amazing soundtrack, oh my god. So yeah, very, very bullet hell -y. Absolutely phenomenal soundtrack. It is interesting. Like, this is a PC-only game, I believe. But it is interesting they've gone for, like, just, like, like this much of the screen. Like, it looks like a mobile game, just because they've gone very vertical. I don't know why they wouldn't just have, like, the whole screen available. But maybe they use it later on in, like, the mystery part of it? Am I damaging this thing? Ouch. I think I must be. Woohoo. I think there's a lot of screen tearing on my end. Hopefully you can't see it. No! Please continue. Oh, weird. Very arcadey. Let's continue. Is it just gonna put me back to the start? No, it puts me right back to this. Great. Uh, you could see at the bottom, it said like, in the bottom right, it said hold fire to join. So it does have local co-op actually. Obviously, I am all by my lonesome. God, the soundtrack's so cool! Holy crap! When it when it first started, I thought it was the the Stoke on Stoke on Trent song from uh, Dick and Dom, I think it is. Stoke on Trent, oh yeah, to Stoke on Trent, historic town on the River Trent. It's a vibrant mix of the great and the good Like Reginald Spitfire Mitchell and Josiah Wedgwood Come and lose yourself in the pottery shopping centre Why not try a snapshot? OK, it's a culinary adventure Come to Stoke on Trent and see just what is meant By that welcome phrase of <laughs> Hey, no, you're in Stoke on Trent Which is like a, a British very British show that I mostly know because of idiots. 
I'd quite like to choose the sound if that's okay. I know you wanted to fart, Michael. I would like the song Stoke on Trent from the popular oh. children's television show uh, Dick, Dick and, and Dom in, in Da Bungalow. Da Bungalow. Oh shit. God, you can probably hear that joystick really clicking away. Nice, we did it. Easy. You've restored the power of... Something? Ooh. Fire two? Aha! God damn it, I can still fight you. I thought this was just a simulation. Oh, fuck. Whoa, okay. Oh, boy. Oh, dead. I, I really, I hate, I hate this thing about, like, continues. Like, that is such an NES thing. And <laughs> that should not be a thing in games. It shouldn't even have been a thing in, in the NES. But, like, you only have a, a certain amount of lives. I forgot to click continue, <laughs> so I was having a mini rant. Is this just going to be like back at the title screen? Uh huh. Because god that is so annoying. Earned a continue, hooray! This is, I'm pretty sure the title screen, okay. This is the story of a fighter who wanted to become Zero Ranger. Great. Start. Uh, start, I guess. Do we just have to start at the beginning again? Yes. Stoke on Trent. Historic town on the River Trent. Just, just that opening bit sounded like it. Okay, well hopefully we can get through this bit pretty quickly. I can get to the other level. Otherwise it's going to be a very short video. Because the people who made this game are using extremely outdated continue mechanics. There should just be checkpoints in games and that's it. Lives are fucking stupid. I'm going to lose all my lives, like, immediately. Is that my health in the bottom left there? Maybe? Can't believe we just have to do the same boss fight again. It's okay, luckily I'm ve- Luckily I'm very good at it. Watch me not even get past this fucking boss now. Might have to focus for it. I'm going to try hard mode. Try hard mode is absolutely helping. I mean, it's pretty easy as far as bullet hells go so far. Ooh. So close to, like, flawlessing it. Holy shit. That's the easiest one, actually. That really spinny one? Wow. So close to taking no shots. Real. Skip. Okay, here we go. Back to the actual level now. Next time you'll make it unscathed, I was very, very close. Just on the boss, at least. Can I do anything with these? Nope. Oh. Ow! Oh my god, he got me from behind. Fuck. Oh. 
Oh my god, this is kind of ridiculous. Oh god. Oh. <laughs> Fuck off. <laughs> Oh god. Oh my goodness. Out of here, sneaky. Oh, this this bit's kind of cool, actually. Oh. Oh. I guess when I'm inside him, I should do this one. Oh, he's gone. <laughs> okay, another boss. <laughs> just instantly died. Okay, I'm ready. Am I gonna have to, like, actually dodge the... these things? Oh, you just have to... S Dude, what the fuck? Okay. Ow. Oh, this is going very, very poorly. Oh my goodness. Fuck, I was at, like, full health going into that as well. I'm ready. Ow! My god. I don't know if try even try hard mode will get me through this. It's helping. I'm so glad I can do this with a controller and not having to just mash my keyboard. Oh my god, I did it. Holy crap. <laughs> Was not expecting that. You've restored the power of that one. I assume the idea is to go and get all eight of these symbols. Uh, I don't know what my new- what the fuck? My new fire thing is. It's this, but it doesn't do anything. Oh, I have to lock onto them? Fuck! I have to get really close, I don't want to do that. Fuck. Is that it? That's, that's just game over? So you have to beat the whole thing in one go? It said I unlocked a continue before. I guess it's just a roguelite then? Uh, I mean, I guess maybe it's just because it's the demo you have to do it all in one go? I don't know, but um, I mean this game is absolutely not for me. I never liked bullet hell games uh like undertale was the only time i somewhat enjoyed bullet hell um i don't know like it's it's really weird that it uses so so little of the screen like this could just be a mobile game <laughs> you would just play it on your phone you hold down the spaceship and move it with your thumb and you'd get about the same the same level of gameplay as you get on a computer so it's kind of weird yeah it's it's not not my kind of thing at all um, maybe people like this, but I don't. <laughs> anyway, that was the Zero Ranger demo. Thank you guys very much for watching. Make sure you leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed this, and I'll see you guys later. Bye! <laughs>